protect yourself against infectious diseases like coronavirus and lifestyle diseases like high blood pressure using ultra modern medical equipment such as face masks, N95 and triple face masks. Medical coverall suits and face shield masks prevents your body from getting in contact with the virus or bacteria. Often check your body temperature using infrared thermometer. Check your blood pressure using automatic blood pressure machines. This message is brought to you by Leviton Investments Limited, importers and distributors of high quality medical equipment located at Arua Park Plaza Shop number 619 and 620 Bench Wanoka Street. Leave it on. Caring for your health. Uh, we have uh, many plans for our customers going forward, especially post-COVID. Uh, we are trying to ensure that uh, we offer many alternative channels of access uh, to our customers uh, whereby they don't not only have to come to our banking halls but can use agents, uh, are able to use the uh, mobile banking platforms, they are able to use the uh, online banking uh, facilities and uh, we've noted quite very good uptake because as we speak now about 30% of our customers are using their phones, mobile banking platform and about 25% uh, of our transactions are through agents and we want to continue driving this and as we do this we want to do it while designing uh, need responsive services and products like the recent uh, center agent a Saint Express account which can be opened remotely without uh, necessarily people having to look for our you know, staff or our physical offices. And this is the kind of direction that we are taking going forward. Going by the mission of the bank, uh, provision of uh, financial services, uh, especially microfinance and especially to those in the rural areas, it goes without saying that uh, assisting people who are involved in the agricultural sector is at the center of our mission. And that's why as we speak, I think we are one of the biggest, if not the biggest bank, that contributes to lending to the agricultural sector. About 18 to 20 percent of our portfolio uh, is, goes to agriculture. We are having a portfolio of uh, slightly over 2 trillion, and 20 percent of that money has been uh, given to people who are involved in agriculture. We have special facilities for people who are coming to borrow for agricultural development. We have uh, designed and developed special teams that look after these people, well knowing how they do their things, and in the process, once they know what they are doing their things, they are able to meaningfully lend to them and offer financial services, and we want to continue doing that. At the moment, of course, because of COVID, uh, a number of our customers have been challenged by the environment in which we are operating. When during lockdown, some businesses uh, didn't operate as expected, cash flows were not generated as they had planned, and in the process, definitely, they had to be uh, challenged as far as making loan repayments is concerned. But what we've done is to work with them to try to see those who deserve loans being rescheduled, we've rescheduled them, and as we try to work out ways of making it easy for them to pay. And in the process, we've journeyed with a number of them, and we believe that as we have the easing of, of the economy come, al come along, we should be seeing a lot of our customers, their businesses coming up and being able to pay the loans that they borrowed from us. The banks are interested in digital solutions, as I mentioned earlier on, because it is one of the ways, the means, of conveniently delivering services to the customers without having to build a brick and mortar, without having to set up physical presence. So that's when they are able to, uh, to, 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 to approach agents. We now have over 4,000 agents. They are able to use mobile banking platforms using their telephones. They are able to use uh, internet banking to be able to access services. And we see this as the trend and we continue to support it because it is the key and the way to be able to continue serving our customers. So how is this helping the cause of financial inclusion? It is definitely helping the cause of financial inclusion because now many more people are able to reach, reach out to us without us being able to set ourselves up physically. 
the tenets of financial inclusion, as we mentioned, is to do with the accessibility, the convenience, um, affordability and of course sustainability. The kind of model that we are designing using technology is a model that enables scalability and therefore sustainability and once we do that then we should be able to reach out to many more people and therefore effective financial inclusion.